Since we're in the DMV and you work with a lot of well, a lot of artists, period, and I know you work with some DMV artists, what artists you feel in the DMV like really top? And that should like some that and get that that top that that notice that should get that notice. Ah oh, man, you gonna do me like that? Yeah. <laughs> all right, all right. So the question is, what artists that didn't get the right. that's they they buzzing here, mm -hmm. but they they should be buzzing. Like they, you, they should like, damn, you should be really. Uh, one of my, one of my favorite artists, and I work with him on like all my albums. Uh, is is I definitely gotta give him his prop. Lizzo from Thrax. That's my man. Yeah, but yeah. I, but him and Flock yeah. together was like, oh man, like Batman. Yeah, Riley, like, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And and I knew you was gonna say him with yeah. Flock. I said you yeah. were gonna say him with Flock. See, see to me like, Flock, Flock. He, uh, um, he, he, his music has made it out of here. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, whether we get into like, you know, if he signed or not, right. but his yeah. his music, like, yeah. like, like, people know who he is. Yeah. You right. know what I'm saying? Right. So that's why when you said yeah. someone that should be there, I, I always, yeah. I always, yeah, yeah. Lizzo, I feel yeah. That Lizzo that's Lizzo my should. bro. He's man. so creative yeah. too. Oh man, man. he's so dope. Yeah, I, just, I, yeah. I, I feel like that, and I just, I, and it's so bad that he never really got like, cause he was telling me that. Me, so I got connections here, I got connections yeah. here. Like he was telling me like, damn, like and, and for me, like me and Lizzo connected so so good working on music, right. um, because I love I love records, I love songs. And he's a hook writer, you right. know what I'm saying? And um and he was one of the uh uh shout out to Lizzo too because he was one of the first artists that uh believed in my vision when I started doing records from an engineer perspective. He was one of the first ones. Uh, the first record I ever did was with Quran. Okay. Um, and uh, it was called All I Want. And that was the very first official record that I put out. But but him and uh, uh, Lizzo, like, they was like, hey, yeah, let's do it. Let's you know what I mean? Yeah. That's what's up, yeah. Man. Yeah, 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 definitely. Lizzo really dope. So I see, and you did a lot of, you did a couple songs with Flock. How many songs do you? Uh, yeah, 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 man. Flock, uh, I, I did multiple records on his projects, okay. and then um, he did some records for me that uh, I, I put out. And shout out to Flock too, cause uh, he uh, he believed in the he believed in my vision. You know what I'm saying? And that that was at that time that record was the biggest record that I put out. You know what I'm saying? So so he believed in it, and uh, you know like you know we killed that record. So. Do y'all have a, what's the record called? Peons? Yeah, Peons. Okay, that was so Peons. How did I put that together? Uh, where was where was it? Like, how? So tell me, like, the whole what happened. So um, at the time, uh, uh, Thrax as a group, um, uh, a lot of people was like, "Yo, Thrax, 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 yeah, Thrax, Thrax." Yeah. <laughs> and uh, what happened was is that I ended up. Uh, I'm I'm always open to music, you know what I'm saying. So when I heard them, I was like, "Yeah, they, they, I was like, yeah, they dope." So. Um, uh, um, as as their record, the two records started growing and growing and growing. Right. You know, they needed to polish their sound, so we ended up just connecting, and uh, that's how I really linked up be, with with Liz and Flock because based off the two records, right. you know. Okay. And then from there, um, I started working with Liz and I was like, yo, like, you know, I I, I can hear it, bro. Right. Like, you got these hooks, like, so so you need to just stay focused, just keep doing it. Right. And then through working with uh, Liz. Everybody around was like, hey, yo, you got to work with Flock. You got to work with Flock. You got to work with Flock. And then I remember just listening to Flock, and I was like, yo, Flock dope. I said, and and, and we just got to get him like, some dope production. Yeah, you get what I'm it. saying? <laughs> so just it was just like, it just you know how it is. Like, we from the same area, so everybody, hey, you know, Flock need to do something. Y'all yeah, need to do something. Course, right. And then um, Flock came through. You know, I told him come through, and I was like, yo, I got, I said, I, just, I told him, I was like, yo, bro, I got some shit I'm working on, my nigga. <laughs> This shit is special. And he was like, yeah, just play it, just play it. And I played him the peons joint. And I'm telling you, that nigga was, I remember it like it was yesterday. The nigga was just chilling. You know, Flock just be chilling, bro. And then he just like, hold on, what the fuck? And then <laughs> he got out. And then um, and then it was just, we was just freestyling the shit. You know what I'm saying? We put it together.